Warriors NRL Fanatics here, back today with a video, and I'm going to be giving you all my NRL tips for round 14. So starting off on Thursday, the 13th of August, the Sydney Roosters versus the Melbourne Storm at the Sydney Cricket Ground, and this kicks off at 7.50pm. Now ins for the Sydney Roosters, Josh Morris is back for the Melbourne Storm, Ryan Pappenhausen and Adele Finucane are in. And outs for the Melbourne Storm, Cameron Munster. In this game, I've got the Sydney Roosters by four. And my first try scorer, I've gone with Joseph Manu. On Friday, the 14th of August, the first of two games on Friday night, sees the New Zealand Warriors versus the top of the table and in form Penrith Panthers at Central Coast Stadium. And this kicks off at 6 p.m. Australia time, 8 p.m. New Zealand time. Now, ins for the New Zealand Warriors, Isaiah Papali is on the bench, and the Panthers, their 1-17, unchanged. Outs for the New Zealand Warriors, Jake Harrington due to suspension. Now, the Penrith Panthers, they're in outstanding form this season. They're showing why they're one of the contenders for the Premiership, uh, Nathan Cleary, he's in outstanding form, and um, this is going to be a very tough game for the Warriors. A big test coming up against a top of the table team in the Penrith Panthers. The Warriors themselves, they're coming off two very good performances and two good wins. One over the West Tigers and one over the Manly Seagulls last week. And they're showing some great performances over the last few months. This is um, a really true test to see where, where the Warriors are at, whether they can make a late push for the finals. Um, yeah, I've got the um, Warriors here. Surprisingly, I'm picking an upset. I think the Warriors can do it, actually. I think they can win this game. I've got the Warriors by six, and my first try scorer, I've gone with George Jennings. But yeah, with no confidence at all, I, I hope I hope we can get up. And um, yeah, good luck to um, Isaac Ritchie. That's his team, the Penrith Panthers. So yeah, it's going to be an interesting game. And it'll be interesting to see how the Warriors go. So the um, next game sees the Parramatta Eels versus the St. George Illawarra Dragons. And this is at Bankwest Stadium. Now this kicks off at 7.35 p.m. Um, ins for the Parramatta Eels, Ryan Madison is in. And for the Dragons, Corey Norman is back. Outs for the Dragons, Jackson Ford, Tarek Sims and Trent Merrin. Now in this game, I think Parramatta Eels will be way too strong for the St. George Illawarra Dragons here. I've got... The, the, the Eels by 18, and my first try scorer, I've gone with Marco Sivo. On Saturday the 15th of August, the first of three games on Super Saturday, sees the Cronulla Sharks versus the Gold Coast Titans at Nostrada Jubilee Stadium, and this kicks off at 3pm. Now, ends for the Sharks, Jake Williams is on the bench, and for the Gold Coast Titans, they're 1-17 to unchanged. Now the Gold Coast Titans, they're, they're showing some great um, improvement this season. They're coming off an outstanding performance and win over the North Queensland Cowboys last week. They absolutely um, flogged the Cowboys. And yeah, they're, they're showing some great signs for the next couple of years. And they've got some good signings. To come as well next year. So yeah. And um, the Sharks they're coming off a very tough loss. Um, this I'm going the Sharks here by two. But it would not surprise me if the um, Gold Coast Titans get up. And yeah they're showing some. They, they were outstanding last week. So yeah I've got the Sharks by two. And my first try scorer. I've gone with the winger from, from the Gold Coast Titans. And that's Anthony Don. The second game on Super Saturday sees the North Queensland Cowboys 
which is the South Sydney Rabbitohs at Queensland Country Bank Stadium. And this kicks off at 5.30pm. Now ins for the Cowboys, Scott Drinkwater is back. He's playing in the he's playing at fullback and John Asiata is on the bench. For the South Sydney Rabbitohs, Jaden Sewer is back. And outs for the North Queensland Cowboys, Justin O'Neill and Tom Gilbert. In this game, I think the South Sydney Rabbitohs will win this. They'll win this by 14. And my first try scorer, I've gone with Alex Johnston. The last game on Super Saturday sees the Canberra Raiders versus the Brisbane Broncos at GIO Stadium. And this kicks off at 7.35pm. Now the Canberra Raiders, they're 1-17 to unchanged. For the Brisbane Broncos, Jordan Ricky is in. And Tipita Pangai Jr. is out for the Brisbane Broncos. In this game, I think the Canberra Raiders here will be way too strong for the struggling Brisbane Broncos. They'll win this by 20. And my first try scorer, I've gone with Nick Kotrick. On Sunday, the 16th of August, the first of two games on Sunday afternoon, sees the Newcastle Knights versus the Manly Seagulls at McDonald Jones Stadium in Newcastle, and this kicks off at 2 p.m. Now, ins for the Manly Seagulls, Brad Parker, Curtis Serenin, and Joel Thompson, and for the Newcastle Knights, Daniel Saifidi is back. In this game, I've got the Newcastle Knights here by 12, and my first try scorer, I've gone with Inari Tuala. The last game of the round sees the West Tigers versus the Canterbury Bull Bankstown Bulldogs at Bankway Stadium, and this kicks off at 4 p.m. Now, ins for the West Tigers, Luke Garner and Josh Reynolds are in, and for the Bulldogs, Herod Holland and Jack Cogger. Outs for the West Tigers are Billy Waters and for the Bulldogs Jack Avarillo and Lachlan Lewis. In this game I've got the West Tigers here West Tigers here by 10 and my first try scorer I've gone with Marcelo Montoya from the Bulldogs. So that is my, um, thank you guys for watching, that is my um, NRL round 14 tips video. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video and share and I'll see you again in the next video.